Phew. It's just you. Learn anything? Islands haunted by a penitent. Spectre punishes the guilty for crimes, foul deeds. Like luring ships onto the rocks, then looting the wrecks. Don't deny it. I found the letter. Longboats sink every so often anyway. That's the sea. That's its nature. They sink near the isle. At least the cargo don't go to waste. We'll come back to that later. Just now, I need your help. But, but, but what? I'm no warrior. Guessed that already. But a curse grips both you and this place, and only you can lift it. Luckily, all you gotta do is light the fire in the lighthouse. Penitent's invincible as long as darkness covers the island. I... I, I can't go outside. It'll kill me. I can f feel it. Mayhaps you could. I'll escort you. Now no excuses. Grab some oil and let's go, before I change my mind. Look! There! It's him! I see it. Now shut your mouth and go light the fire. Remember, you fail, the penitent will kill me, then come for you. Hurry up. Don't know how much longer I can manage this. Did it work? It did, but that doesn't make the island safe, because you're still here. A lightkeeper who lures ships onto the rocks. Sheesh. I made a mistake. I know this now. Swear by Frey and all the gods never again. Absolutely never. As soon as we're done talking, you're gonna pack up and leave. For good. Understand? But I... We...
I, Geralt? I killed the monster from the lighthouse. It was a penitent, very dangerous specter, and very rare. Why did it ever appear on Eldberg? It's been a peaceful island always. Even sirens haven't nested there. Someone committed a crime there, did something terrible. Long story short, you'll need a new lightkeeper. Never mind that. Let's talk about my reward. Aye, yes. Got it right here. Earned every last coin you did. And a round. Cheers to your health. Those two boys, the pesky ones, who were they? Corey and Cracky. Only ever troublesome, as is their father, Leif. He interesting in some way? Depends. If it's liars and cards that interest you, then very much so. I don't often raise such a hubbub. You must rarely get guests from the continent. Aye, true. When a Redanian or Tamarian grows the stones to come to Skellige, they usually go ashore at Kertrolda. Port's good there. Merchants are plenty. And the Jarl's right merciful to Continentals. So long. Taste for Skellige meat, vagrant. It's not bad, thanks. Huh. Then get yourself a cake for the road. And fuck off. I see you lads still don't understand the law of hospitality. Tough. Seems I got to pound it into you. Thanks, Jorand. Pounding's always better with a partner. Lots, come here! We've a brawl! Are some miserable shits. Stay calm. Get you a healer. No point. Pierce me lung. I'll drown in my own blood or too long. Pour a nip off for me at times. For Jorant, son of Sigvald. Her lived honorable. Died like a fool. Your lads, they. What about them? Speak, damn it. They're dead. That's the foreigner's hand. Corey! Crack it! Had but two sons, and you killed them. You ended my line. Sorry. But I didn't start it. Does this stranger speak the truth? Who first drew a blade? Dunno. It happened fast, and we were a few horns in. I killed the monster from the lighthouse, the beast that haunted you. This how you repay me? Paid you in gold. We owe you nothing more. Don't want any more bloodshed. But I'll defend myself if I have to. You'll make your defense before the Jarl. Only if Madman Lugos calls you innocent will you be free to go. I'm to be judged by somebody you yourselves call Madman? That, or fight the whole village. And you'll never defeat us all. Not with three swords you won't. Fine. Lead the way.
Just had to stop by that damn tavern. When's my trial? When the Jarl summons you. It won't be soon. The longer a man crushes rocks, the less eager he is to give Leptune trial. This one's waited a year. That one, three. But see, Lugos said my trial would be today. Don't remember? Oh, I... Right. Uh, come on. My land dates back to the times of Uben the Great. This dog ended it. He's gotta die. I passed judgment here, Leif. Remember that. But he's a vagrant, a foreigner. He don't deserve a trial, not even death by the sword. He... Now go on. I want to hear this. Geralt, didn't think I'd see you again so soon. You invited me to your lands, Lugos. Said I'd find work here. Hey, killing monsters, not men. Let's get to it. Leif claims you killed his sons, Cory and Kraki. What do you say to that? Fought to defend myself, and your end. None came forth to confirm your words. And none will. Always easier to hang an outsider than to try one of your own, right? Ha! Huh. Tongue as sharp as your blades. Sharp? He insults me! Insults our whole clan! The Codex of Ancestors says... Quiet! I made my decision. Gerald of Rivia. I find ye guilty on two counts of murder. Punishment's death by suffocation. But you can buy your way out by paying Cory and Crocky's weight in silver. You know I don't have that kind of coin. Unless those boys were a lot lighter than they looked. I'm well aware of that. I'll pay the blood price myself. What? That's against every law! I make the laws here! Go home, Leif, because if you rail me, I'll tie this bag of silver round your neck and toss you in the sea. Nice gesture, though I'm guessing it doesn't come free. Tell me, Witcher, have you any honor? I do. I paid life on your behalf. That puts you in my debt, a debt of pride. You ought to do as I say. So, listen carefully. My lad, Blue Boy Lugos, has ventured out, but not against the Black Ones, nor to loot a convent. Got the notion to go to the Cave of Dreams, south side of the Isle, and none return from there. You're clever and good with a sword, Two traits that rarely go together. So, you're to help him. I need an heir, no matter his mother. Take your things and do as I say, or lose your dignity and good name for all time. Greetings. What do you want? 
Someone's in a good mood. What the mood would you be in if you'd lost your son? Still masking. What do you want? Wouldn't mind a look at your stock. So be it. Like you to craft. Fine. Show me. It's easier somehow when I have work to do. Your son. What happened to him? Drowned. Finback tipped the boat he was on. For his first journey into northern waters. Sorry to hear it. Sea swallowed his body. I'll not bury him. He'll not feast with his ancestors. Take care now. Uh huh. Watch yourself, white. Ooh. Come on now. What do you want? Want to talk to Blue Boy Lugos? 
Hear that? He wants to talk to Lugos. What else, Vagrant? Care to plough Freya? Lugos is expecting me. Lead the way. Um, right. Come on. Why? I don't get it. Then stay here. Think it over. By this death yard. Too much drink. They say Know the last time I had a Continental on my ship? No. When I hauled prisoners from Velen to the slave market in Nazar. Now, tell me why you're here. Your father felt you could use a witcher's help, and I owe him a favor, so... Told him not to meddle. Told him I'd manage fine on my own. Maybe that's not entirely true. Cave of Dreams. Supposed to be a dangerous place. Mortally so, but that's my reason for going there. Fine, so be it, I take you. Old man's like to throw a fit elsewise. Or he's about to go, you ready? What awaits us in the Cave of Dreams? Depends wholly on us, cuz... Yeah, I'd explain later. We can go. Is it far? Nah, our stones throw. Let's gather the lads and go in. We'll know soon if there's truth to the legends. Girls, these are the best warriors in me crew. They'll come with us. You know Yarulf, called the Wolverine? Good day. And this here is Uv Jabberjaw. Before we head off, will you tell me about this cave? You can at least tell me what we might have to fight. Only you can know that. Elders say in the Cave of Dreams you face your greatest fears. Face what makes you wake up at night, screaming. Something that's already been, will be, or just might be. I do wonder what a monster slayer fears. But we've talked enough, lads. Swords in hand. Let's go! Totem! Right where it should be. Now's when we eat the herbs. Why would we do that? To go on. To where the nightmares are. So says the legend. And so we will do. What herbs are these? Hmm. What'd that druid say? Hemlock, poppy, nightshade, and that chicky. No, uh, henbane. In for one hell of a ride. Fine. Give him here. Take it. Oof. Yarl, eat up to the last grain. I don't feel no different. How about you, Oof? Asking a mute his opinion. You're feeling it, mate. 
Come on, let's go. Time to face our fears. robbed you your senses. It's not possible. I see you're weary from the battle. Sit with me, son. Have some mead. Pretty telling your adventures. Thank you, my king. We... I shan't drink with you, old man. And I shan't call you king. Get off that throne while you've still strength in your decrepit bones. Ooh, you can talk. Uh, I... 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 I didn't... But I... <gasps> you insult me once more, old Jabberjaw. The first time I left you to punish yourself and retain your honor, but now... Now you'll die like a thrall and eels will eat your remains. Not your lucky day. <laughs> Wings, these here. It's the 
as if they're swimming through the air. Clear my conscience. Let's go. Nothing. You fear nothing, boy. You! You pissed your trousers when night and struck the train by our wall. Three years old. I've shown a hundred times since then that I. You pissed yourself before the whole village. The yarl son. Ah, the shame should have punished you. You're a vision, a spectre. A vision of your dad, who you fear, because you know you don't live up to him. You know you disappoint him. 
I'm a better warrior than he ever was. Prove it, you little shite. Get off, Garrett. You've paid your debt. You're a free man. Gonna tell your father what you faced in the Cave of Dreams? Of course I will. I've no fear of him, right? Twas an honor to fight at your side. Farewell, Garrett.